Hello, it's Marco Matosh, Chief of Mark on 3D, and today we're going to be creating decal materials. So here I've got a decal material. If I open it up, we can see that it's covered in an alpha, um, and we see we've got these spots around the middle. So let's close that. From here, I'm going to right click on the texture and go create material, and we will just call this whatever we want. Let's now double click to open it up. So from here, the first thing we do is we have everything deselected, come over into material domain and change surface to deferred decal. From here, the blend mode will be translucent. From here, I can get the alpha and we can put this in the opacity. And if we have a look over here on the left, we can see that there's a bit of opacities there. However, if I want to make it stronger or a little bit weaker, what I can do is I can right click, type in constant, and we choose constant three vector. From here, I'm gonna right click and type in multiply, and there we have it. So now let's get our RGB from our texture and put it in here, also from our constant vector three up the top there and put this into the base color. So from here, we can see that it's very harsh. I can come into here, change the color of our constant. There we go, and we see that it's not so harsh. From here we save and we go back to our main level. And so now we've got our decal material down here. Let's add in a decal up in the search classes. We type in decal, click and drag the decal in, and I'm just gonna scale it in a little bit. From here, I'm gonna get the material grunge 01 decal that we just created and put it over into the decal material. And there we have it. We can now see our decal affected on our smooth shiny ground if you like these short quick tutorials make sure you subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with any other tutorials that i'm releasing on unreal engine and blender